And if, I don't know if you can hear the difference, but that definitely has more presence than where I'm speaking right now. On Monday, I hosted an acting class with some students from my old high school, PSJ Memorial. And it was basically a follow-up to the video that I had sent them, giving them steps to follow in order to prepare for their audition. And these steps they can also use just to prepare for rehearsal, preparing how to act, anything like that. I hear about Annie all the time, even though after she's graduated, I hear all the amazing stuff she's done and the stuff she's doing right now. And I think it, it's the experience overall. I think if you had a good and great time, you always want to come back and visit the directors who helped you so much in your high school experience. I think we each have uh, an obstacle that we need to overcome, I think, in our years of theater. And being able to ask her head on what those obstacles and some tips how we can overcome them, it was, it was really nice. So I asked her, What's a good way to get thoughts out of your head? Because I'm always thinking on stage, oh my gosh, I'm gonna forget my line, I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna trip, like stuff like that. And so she said to mainly just think about your character, think about why are they saying these lines? Why are they doing this? Why are they talking to the specific person? And how are they feeling? Like, are they mad? Are they angry? Are they sad? You know, stuff like that. And I think that was really helpful because I tend to get in my head a lot when I'm on stage. I wanted her to address uh, their fears and and how to overcome their fears and sure enough they they brought up the fact that they uh, lack confidence um and so i like that you know we can tell them um what we think but you know we're grown-ups and so i like that they can talk to somebody uh closer to their age and i think that they can identify with them a lot better um and so i like that annie brought up a lot of the a lot of their concerns so we want to make this a series you know and um, right now we're at we're reaching out to former students and we're seeing um, what they can bring to the table and um, we definitely want to get different perspectives uh, you know how do they um, how do they get out of their fear how do they find their confidence um, what you know tips and tricks can can you teach them for um, you know things like um, enunciating words so uh, we're gonna reach out to them we're gonna reach out to some former students and anybody else that we can think of and hopefully create a series throughout the summer throughout the year to get them um, to get them ready and just so they can hear from other people I think that's extremely important I hope that there's a relationship between the high schools and the alumni to come back and help lift each other up because the same way that I had to learn and realize that my community is gonna be here for me regardless of all the negative things that I wanna tell myself in my brain, that it's also important to see that. And I think having alumni come back and showing the students, hey, there's more of us than you think there is, is super, super important. So yeah, I hope this is something that can continue for all of PSJ.